What are big and slow and gray all over? The crawler transporters. But don't let the slow speeds fool you. These twin behemoth machines have carried the load of taking rockets and spacecraft to the launch pads for decades. Originally built in Ohio, Crawler Transporter 1 moved for the first time under its own power in 1965. Two years later, Crawler Transporter 1 moved the first Saturn V rocket to the launch pad in Florida for the uncrewed Apollo 4 mission. Four years later, both Crawler Transporters 1 and 2 carried the remaining Apollo Saturn V rockets to the launch pads. Both crawlers carried all the space shuttles from 1981 through the end of the shuttle program in 2011. In 2000, both crawler transporters were added to the National Register of Historic Places, signifying their impact in human spaceflight and American history. Crawler Transporter 1 wasn't updated at the end of the shuttle program and could only lift 12 million pounds. Crawler Transporter 2, or CT2 for short, was modified to lift 18 million pounds, which is needed to transport the space launch system for Artemis missions. CT2 remains operational thanks to a dedicated team of engineers who maintain the 6.6 .6 million pound vehicle. In 2023, Guinness World Records officially designated CT2 as the heaviest self-powered vehicle in the world. And in 2024, it achieved the milestone of 2,500 miles traveled. Under Artemis, with CT2, NASA will send the first woman, first person of color, and first international astronauts to the moon since the Apollo missions.